Hello everyone, in today's video, I am back with another weekly cash stuffing and this is gonna be for week number three of August. Uh, let's go ahead and get straight into it. This week we are working with a total of $1,167. So this past week I did get back from Nashville on Wednesday, I was only able to work Thursday, Friday, Saturday. On Thursday I made 478, Friday was 479, and then Saturday was $210. So let's go ahead and count this. I obviously am not going to be able to put away any extra income this week. If you guys have watched a couple of my previous videos, you know that I've been putting away a few hundred bucks from my income to put towards future income whenever I'm on vacation. Unfortunately, I'm not able to do that this week, but we're gonna go ahead and get to stuffing. So let me get this counted. We have 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 80, 8, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, that's 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Perfect. Let's so make this organized. Okay, I think that looks pretty good. If you guys hear any background noise, my boyfriend and my son are home. They are in uh, the living room, so you might hear them talking. I do have my sister and my friend coming over for dinner, so I wanted to go ahead and get this filmed. But getting straight into bills, starting off with rent. Rent is gonna get $250. Also, really quickly, guys, I wanted to uh, just say thank you to all the really kind comments that you guys had for me on my previous video. All of the um, kind words about me having fun in Nashville and so glad you had fun in Nashville. I really, really appreciate that. You guys are the best supporters ever. So I just wanted to put that out there before we get started. But 250 is going in to bills. So that's going to be 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, and this nasty 10 makes 50. Let me double count that just to make sure. So 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50. And actually, um, I'm super OCD about this, but I don't want to mix 100. So let me grab another hundreds worth of 20s, 20, 40, 60, 80, and one. And we'll do that instead, and I'll use that 100 somewhere later on. Okay, so let's get rent counted. So rent now has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000, 20, 40, 60, 80, that's 100, 20, 30, 40, 50. So $1,150 now in rent. Next up is car payment. Car payment's getting $50. So let's do two 20s and 10. So 20, 40, 50. And that brings car payment to 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50. So 250 is now in car payment. Next up is my subscriptions envelope. If you guys are new here, I do split all of my household bills with my boyfriend. So rent, water, trash, electric, um, subscriptions, all those things get split in half. This is my half. I'm gonna go ahead and put $5 into subscriptions this week. So, um, yeah, let's put a $5 bill. That's fine. Actually, you know what? I am going to put these five ones back. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm just going to take a 10 instead because I think I need those ones later. So that brings subscriptions to 50 bucks. Okay, cell phone. I do pay for my son's and my cell phone. That's going to get $20 this week as well. Or $20 this week. Bring cell phone to 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. Electricity is up next and it's getting 40 bucks. So 20, 40. That brings electric to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. So 190, this is exactly what I needed for my part of the electric and it actually came out yesterday out of my bank. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this off to the side because I need to put this in my deposit folder so I can take this money to the bank to get that paid. So we're starting off fresh for this next month. Child care is up next, it's getting 70. So we'll do three 20s and a 10. 
And that brings child care to 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 210. So 210 in child care. Internet is getting $5. So I think I'll just throw five. And that brings internet to 20, 40, 45, 50. Dental insurance up next. It is also getting five. So I'm gonna put this five back. I'm gonna grab a 10. That brings dental insurance to 30. Health insurance is getting $10. So I'm gonna go and put this 10 back and grab a 20. And that brings health insurance to 45. So that is now fully funded. My health insurance is $43. We're going to have a little bit of buffer for next month, which is great. Credit card, I do, if you guys have seen my videos, you know that I do do my credit card expenses beforehand. I do them off camera. So this is just money that I spent from this past week. Debt fund is up next. It's getting 250. Dang it. I'm going to have to use that 100. Uh, let's see. 250. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this 50 back. And I'm going to grab 300 instead. So that's 100. And then I'm going to grab 220s. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 80. 2. Let me make sure that's right. So it should be 300. 1, 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. Yes. Okay, let's get this counted. Let's put this one off to the back. All right, so debt fund now has 1, 2, 3, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 50. So $750 is now in debt fund. And I am currently using this for traveling. So most of this, actually probably all of this, is going to go towards my Europe vacation. I actually finally uh, booked my all my Airbnbs for all of the cities I'm going to be traveling to. We're going to Athens, to Florence is where I'm spending most of my time in Italy. And then we're going to uh, end off in Rome. We're flying out from Rome. So I booked an Airbnb for there as well. But it's actually around $715. So probably most of this is going to go towards that. But I'll do that um, off camera probably just so I can get all my expenses correct. So uh, okay, let's go and move on to the next binder income. This is going to be the money that I was talking about earlier. So I have been putting away that money for the future vacations. That's in there. It's 600. But a total of 705 went into bills. Moving on to cash envelopes, starting off with gas. We still have 20 from last week. So I'm going to go ahead and put 20 in here for this week to make it 40. So that now has 40 bucks. And... Groceries is going to get 80 this week. So I'm going to go ahead and do just four twenties. You can make change later. So 80 bucks going into groceries. Spending is up next. It's getting 25. This is for my personal spending. So I'm going to put a 20 and a five. Try to limit myself this week so I wouldn't spend as much. I'm really been working a lot, honestly. So I've been working doubles at least two days a week if I can. Uh, so most of my time is spent at work right now, so I'm not even spending money outside of work, so this should be plenty. Moving on to dine out, this is an envelope I use for my boyfriend and I, and it is getting 15. So I'm gonna put this five back and just grab a 20. That brings dine out to 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And I told you guys that during, uh, in Nashville, we did do the escape game or escape room. I can't remember what it's called, but super fun. We actually, it was so much fun that while we were there, they had a deal where you could get 20% off a future visit. So we got a gift card to do the one here in my hometown. And we're going to be doing that sometime in the next couple weeks. So that's really exciting. But um, Tides is up next. It's getting 10. So let me go ahead and put $10. And that brings that to 30. And then really quickly, I'm gonna go ahead and throw that $190 in deposit. And just for funsies, I'll go ahead and count how much we have in here. So we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 30. So 230 going to the bank. And a total of $150 went into cash envelopes. That leaves 312 for sinking funds. Of course, I'm going to start off with my 
Zivopoly challenge. Love this challenge. I've mentioned this to you guys multiple times. I absolutely love that I don't know how much I'm going to end up saving. I love that it's like a game, that it's like fun. I highly recommend if you can find one on Etsy, totally do it, do it with me. Keep me updated, let me know how much you guys are saving. Last week we were on save five. And what I try to do whenever I look at this board is I try to figure out how, like what the most is that I'll have rolled. So one through six, what's the most that's gonna be spent for the week. And this would be 20. So I have a leftover of 20. And that doesn't always work. Sometimes I don't have the funds to do so, but if I can, that's what I try to do. But let me get my die and my expo marker. Again, we were on save five. Let's see what we are gonna put in this week. So four, one, two, three, four, right? One, two, three, four. So this way this works is chance is times 10 the roll and then community chest is times five. So four times five is 20, which is perfect because that's what I had saved. And I'm gonna go ahead and mark that and throw a $20 bill into the Saveopoly challenge. I'm also gonna put that on here that I put that in there. Perfect. And we will continue on with our stuffing. Not gonna count this. I think you guys have probably know by now. I'm not gonna count this until the end of the year. I'm gonna be surprised. I'm gonna throw that back in there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get into the OG Sinking Fun Binder. Starting off with Christmas. Christmas, I'm gonna put 25 in there this week. So we'll do a 20 and a five. And that brings uh, Christmas to five, six, six fifty, seventy, ninety, seven, ten, thirty, fifty, seventy five. So seven hundred and seventy five now in Christmas. Essentials up next. I very much depleted this envelope this past week. I had to get vitamins and they had like a buy one, get one fifty percent off. So I went ahead and stocked up on those. So I did deplete this. I'm gonna go ahead and put five dollars in here. So what I'll do is put this five back. I'm gonna grab a ten instead. Actually, I'm gonna grab a 20. Why not? Nah, no, 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 I'll grab a 10. Okay, so that brings essentials to 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 25 is now in there. My son's envelope is up next. He's getting his usual $25. And I'm gonna go ahead and, let's see, that would be 30 and that would be 40. So I'm gonna grab two 20s instead. So that brings his envelope to 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 450, 70, 90, 5, 10, 30, 50. So that's $1,550 in his envelope. Just super exciting because that means I get to do a $500 slip on my next unstuffing. I'm actually gonna be changing on a lot of these, so that should be a pretty big stuffing. You guys stay tuned for that one. It's at the end of the month. Vacation's up next. It's getting 50, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw that $50 bill in here. So that brings vacation to 1,000, 2,000, 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50. So that's 2150. Yes, 2150 in vacation now, which is great. Clothing is up next. It is getting five. So I'm gonna throw a $5 bill in here. And that brings vacation to 20, 40, 45, 50, one, two, three, four, five. So 55 is now in clothing. Next up is my car insurance and it is getting 35. And you know what, I'm just gonna put, let me move this over really quickly. I'm gonna put 20, 30, and five. And that brings car insurance to one, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. That's 200, 510. So 210 now in car insurance. Birthday is up next and it is getting $5. So I'll go ahead and I guess I'll put five ones in there because I don't have any. One, two, three, four, five. That brings birthday to 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, 100, one, two, three, four, five. So 105 is now in birthday. Uh, next birthday coming up is actually my own. So I might or might not use this for my vacation, but I'll let you guys know. Household is up next and it's getting $5. 
And just so you guys know, this is going to completely be depleted because I just went to Bath and Body Works and stocked up on their little um, scent refill. I don't forget, oh, wallflowers. I, I stocked up on their wallflower scents. They're having a sale, five for 25 right now, and I had to go get some. So I'm gonna go ahead and deplete, deplete this this next week, just so you guys are aware. Up next is my hustle envelope. This is used for my channel. Putting $5 in here. So I'll just do a $5 bill. Fix this really quick. And that brings hustle to 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. Car maintenance is getting five. So I'll put a $5 bill in here as well. That brings car maintenance to five, six, 650, 70, 80, 85, 90. So $690 now in car maintenance. Diapers, this is for future children and it's getting two bucks. So I'll do one, two. And that brings diapers to 50, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 71, 2, 3, 4. So 74 is now in diapers. Same with wedding. Wedding is for a future wedding. It is also getting two bucks. And I'm sure you guys are probably curious. Um, I know I would be curious if, if I were y'all. Um, wedding isn't a priority for my boyfriend and I. We have some investing that we want to do, some real estate stuff. So it's definitely something we've discussed. It's just going to be probably in the future. But wedding is now getting 50, 60, 65, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 74 now in wedding. Okay, so that is going to be all for that binder. Moving along to the other sinking fund binder, annual fleet, annual fleet. <laughs> annual fee is completely funded so we are good on that holiday fund though i'm gonna put 10 bucks in trying to get those holiday or those are sorry those uh, halloween costumes and i think this year we want to do um star wars so that's super exciting my my son wants to be luke skywalker so we'll see about that but um holiday uh, yeah holiday fund now has 20 40 50 60 registration not stuffing and if you guys are if you guys are thinking Girl, you need to really get your registration done. It's been out. I, you're right. And I am, I promise. I promise I am. I, unfortunately, I thought I would be able to do it online, even right, you know, right past the expiration date. I was not. So now I have to go up to the office, which is the worst experience in the entire world. I did it last year. I hated it. And now I'm absolutely regretting my decision to wait, but it is getting done. I promise you guys. And I will deplete that very, very, very soon. Uh, dental fees is up next. It is getting a dollar. Just gonna grab a dollar bill. That brings dental fees to 1, 20, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 145 now in dental fees. Which is great because I think I have a cavity that I need to get done. I actually have a lot of dental work that needs to get done. I need to get some crowns put on, but you know, I do need to get a cavity filled, so hopefully I'll be able to use that soon. Tattoo fund is up next. It's getting $5. So that brings tattoo fund to 50, 70, 80, 95, 100. So 100 is now in tattoo fund. Back to school. Let's see. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna stuff this one. Uh, I mentioned to you guys before, my son is already back to school. This is probably gonna be for some uniform stuff in the fall or the winter to get him some pants. So I think we're pretty good there. But moving along to emergency fund, it's getting its usual $22. So we'll do a 20. And two. And that brings emergency fund now to five, six, 20, 40, 60, 75, six, seven, eight, nine, 80, one, two. So $682. Yes. Yes. $682 now in emergency fund. Beauty's up next. Beauty is getting 10 bucks. So we'll just throw a $10 bill in here. I did set up an appointment to get my hair cut, um, I think September 12th or something like that. Anyway, that is getting done. I'm hoping that I would think, I think I want to do like a curtain bang type of thing. I have not done that trend for myself yet and maybe it's already passed it, but I think it's a really cute style. If you have curtain bangs or if you have those kind of bangs, let me know how high maintenance it is because most of the time my hair is up in a clip. So I'm looking for something a little bit lower maintenance. I know that that definitely you have to style, but uh, if you love that, if that's what you're doing with your hair and it's something that you recommend, let me know. 
but that brings beauty to 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 60, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So $185 now in beauty. Lastly is Roth. This should be $75. Um, I really hope it is because I've really been messing up recently and I get to this envelope and it's not right. So let me go ahead and count this. I appreciate you guys always for letting me know where I made the mistake. Uh, let's see. So we have 20, 30, 40, 55, 65. Nope. Yeah. No. 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yay. We did it. Let me go ahead and get this counted for you guys. All right, so that brings Roth now to 1,000, 2,000, 1, 2, 3, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 80, 90. That's 500, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 2,575 dollars. I lost count. I think that's right. If not, I'll put it on the screen. But I think it's 2,575 dollars. So this is another envelope that I will be able to put a new um, $500 slip in, which is really exciting. But that concludes this week's cash stuffing, y'all. Hopefully this next week, I have been working for the past couple days. Um, I will be able to have put some extra money into the income folder. It should be a little bit higher this next week. So definitely stay tuned. But thank you guys so much for watching. Again, thank you for your kind words and your support. If you like this video, please give it a like down below and I will see you in my next video. Thanks guys. Bye.